Hi, everyone. So who are we? So Target Integration was established in 2008 with the mission that every business should be able to leverage the full power of their business insights. So we have offices in Ireland, United Kingdom, three in India, um, and recently the United States. And we also have a development center in Greece in Thessaloniki. So target integration provide a perfect mix of quality and value. So we basically do implementations, we do integrations for our clients, we do migrations, um, and we just like to, you know, match the best solution with the client's, um, you know, business issues, uh, essentially. So clients come with us, um, cli clients come to us uh, looking for solutions. And even if we can't find the perfect one from them on our side, we will make sure to give an educated um, opinion um, based on what they have given us. In this video, we'll be looking at forecasting within Zoho CRM. With forecasts, users can estimate revenue based on data within Zoho CRM. It's also possible to establish, assign, and edit sales quota for salespeople and teams. Managers can identify individual and team performance, measure forecast accuracy against commit accounts, and create fully customizable forecast reports and dashboards. Let's look at how to create a forecast within Zoho CRM. So a forecast module might not always be there for you. So you can click these three horizontal buttons and search for the forecast module or just scroll down and you'll be able to find it. Now this is what it should look like for you if you've never used the forecast module, but let's get started. So the forecast hierarchy would be by role, the target period, you can select a period in which you want this to apply to. So either monthly or quarterly, I'm going to click monthly and you enter when your fiscal year begins. So your financial year within your business and the target field. You can select from the drop down. Let's see by amount you can just click save. This essentially just says that you are set in targets for your business. And then we now go into this and it says create forecast for CEO. So this is created by role hierarchy base, as I mentioned previously. So the target year and month, March, let's select the tag target as 10,000. So Target for sub roles, you can create this if you want to, if you had more individuals within the organization or target for users with this role. So it's gonna leave that. I'm gonna click save and you have now created a forecast. So um, you've created your target, you've set your target and you can also set targets as I said previously for sub hierarchies and managers of each sub hierarchy and individual users in the hierarchy and sub hierarchy. So this can either be role based or territory based. Now, once the forecast is created, you can add deals to each month. When the deal is closed, it will automatically appear under forecast history. All the deals created will show under each individual salesperson's monthly forecast list for a follow up. So this is the, the forecast in which it shows so you can associate deals with the forecast. And that is our initial forecast created. And that's how you create them within Zoho Serum. Thank you.